Hello everyone, this is my third video log in which I am sharing my experience uh, implementing Shopify POS app using an existing Ionic application. So let's get started. Uh, so till now we tried using the Shopify average but uh, there were some issues due to the TypeScript version so we were not able to use that. So today I tried my hands on this uh, Shopify embedded app as SDK. So for this uh, we need to include a JS file and uh, uh, I think the uh, I tried uh, we uh, I tried two of the options one was to include that using uh, any of the libraries available and another one was to uh, uh, include it in the index.html so I uh, I went for the first option. Uh, I use the script.js library. Uh, through this, I uh, I loaded the uh, embedded app SDK. Then uh, uh, we need to initialize it using the API key and shop origin. So uh, uh, I initialized it, and uh, so uh, based upon the code uh, uh, shared by the Uh, the Shopify team I tried implementing the same code uh, I was able to get the user to the installation page and uh, then uh, on successful installation I did got a code from that uh, uh, user redirecting to my app uh, after uh, doing that I faced one of the issue in which uh, the uh, user was again and again redirecting to the to my same application I have to do further handlings for the same uh, as uh, uh, as I was dealing with that uh, I again uh, read the Sh Shopify average and uh, there was something that I missed out earlier I guess uh, there is also a JS uh, support available so uh, I tried using it and uh, uh, I was able to use uh, the JS file and access the average object, uh, object and uh, perform the same uh, operations that I did with the embedded app SDK and uh, but still, I'm I, I, today I was facing the same redirect issues. But the good part is I'm I was able to get the average running because soon the embedded app SDK would be uh, the support would be co completely void. So uh, it's better we we are with the latest uh, SDK. So. Uh, uh, we were able to use that today uh, the use the average but still uh, we are facing some of the issues uh, handling the redirects as we are doing that from the root page so uh, the plan for uh, plan further would be to uh, try to uh, create uh, some more modules or to handle it more efficiently Thank you.